let's compare Briar bases and see why we like our steel bases so much more than the Briar original plastic bases. Let's take a look at them side by side. This is the original Briar plastic disc base. Very thin, concave, like a bowl underneath. Next to our steel base, which is flat all the way across, so it gets full surface contact with the ground or the table, and is made of solid steel with a solid steel peg. Let's look at how they get used. We have Mr. Wasile here, and Wasile came with this base. This is his very own original base. Now, when we go to put this on him, let's try it here first. Can we just set him onto it? We certainly cannot. Pushing down on the table, shaking the table, not going on him. To get this on him, we have to really push hard, you can hear it, twisting and pulling into his foot. Now we can see why so many of these break. One, they have to get pushed on really hard with this very thin plastic. Two, being concave, once you set them down, they're like a suction cup. When they get pressure on them, they want to spread out. And that helps increase those spiderweb cracks. So when you, when he stands there for a while, or when you go to pull a base on or off, eventually it just fails. It breaks, the horse topples over. Not a good day for anybody. And to take it back off, same thing. I have to twist them and pull at the same time. And you can see what an effort that was to get that off from him. All right, let's try one of our steel bases. Do you like this one better, Wassail? Oh, look, he sets right down onto it. No pushing, no pulling, no twisting. He's sturdy. He didn't go all wobbly when I put him on it. I can tip him. He's gonna actually try to come back to center because these bases are heavy. They weigh almost a quarter pound a piece. So they provide a good solid anchor. They're shiny, they look nice in shows, and they're good and stable on your shelves.